All right, we're going to be doing bidding GC PIP and PIP DC maker quotes, in which for uh, PIP DC maker, there's nothing we look at. We don't care about bid due date or common project. So if we open up this project, we see we have an amount, which is good. Every project here, we need an amount to quote it. So we come here. Uh, I'm going to leave our, whoever's related here, we'll, we'll leave that company. We have no proposal created, so all we will do is say proposal. Most of these we should not have a proposal created. If we had a proposal created, we would have, should have quoted the project at that time. In USA, we use the info email. In Canada, we use Glenn. In UK, we use Ken. So last night we were getting stuck on here. It was not going all the way. It was just, oh, there it goes, it went. It went meaning it created the document. Our proposal is gonna be here. We're gonna duplicate our page because we're gonna have to share this document in our email. We're using a PIP DC maker template. We're gonna send, we're gonna select our template from quotes. PIP DC maker quote one. Quote one means this is the first PIP DC maker we, we've sent this account or contact today. We cannot send the same account to the same templates in one day. Or we have two Brian Hatches here. Our Brian Hatch works is on this project, Phillies Mormon. The account for Phillies Mormon is Big D. If we go there to the lookup, we look at the Brian Hatch from Big D. There's two Brian Hatches. Sometimes we have six or seven contests with the same exact name. Now we have to hit our estimate quote date. And we have an error. Um, we have some type of error here. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna keep this, I'm gonna show our developers. And uh, I wanna see if it's sent, if our proposal sent. we we'll tell them why trying to send an email from the template did not go. I see today's not, today's 12.8. We're looking at 12.4 here. I know why it didn't go. Our partner is not active. That's why. So we remove our partner. We come down to our left. We take construction clean partners, which is us. We paste that there. Then So we come here now, we're gonna have to delete our, uh, our document because the proposal has the old company's name on it. Now we say proposal again with our new company name, which is us, Construction Clean Partners. We don't ever change our, our templates. We use the info Google Drive for USA. Then we're gonna duplicate our um, opportunity so we can drag, so we can share our series file. We're gonna copy, send an email. We're going to use the PIP DC maker quote one. 
we're going to share our quote. We already have our quote day estimated as today. Our next project is a bidding GC with a bid due date, no comment. Oh yeah, don't forget we have two Brian Hatches. Ours works for Big D. We have two bid, we have a bid due date. No, um, it's not common. We have no square footage or an amount. There's a link here. I wanna see what this link says. Is there an easy viewing of a square footage? Project not found. It's not an easy way to get the square footage. So we come down here and say, we can't just turn estimate proposal quotable to no. We have to turn this to no also. So plans pricing directly, plans pricing on file directly affects estimate proposal quotable. I wanna just turn, I wanna just turn this no, but we can't turn this no if this is yes. Plans pricing on file, right now they work hand in hand together. So as you see on some of these projects, um, but we're not gonna be able to quote them. So I look at all these and say, hmm, can we quote these? Even though it says it's quotable, we have no amount or square footage. Uh, this project is actually, um, I know it's a retail. This is not required, but I also know it's a common project. We have a, we have a quote created. Why didn't we quote this already? We did on 11.25. So that means we come down here to estimate quote date and we say 11.25 was the day we quoted. I saw, if I saw a proposal, then I said, hmm, why is this day we didn't quote it? Then I looked down here at our emails and saw the, the template called quote on 11.25. Our project impact, the one we're on is impact services, is project in progress. Bid due date is irrelevant for project in progress and PIP DC maker. Bid due date only counts for BI, uh, bidding GC. Bidding GC is when the account is quoting the project. So what we'll do here is we don't have a partner. We need a partner. Every, all these should have a partner. If there's no partner, we'll take our construction clean partner's name. We paste, partner search date was today. The day we give it a partner is the partner search date. And we need a contact also. How do we get a contact? We have our final clean scheduler contact that works for construction clean partners. We need a contact that works for Domus. So we go to Domus. And we're gonna say new, create a new contact, add a new contact, who'll be the primary. We're gonna grab our key estimating contacts. That's what we wanna get. We have no key estimating. So we take our contact with the oldest day since last activity, that's emailable. So we have two guys that are 61 right here. I'll grab one of them, I'll grab Brian. Making the primary. No roles needed. As long as we have the primary checkbox, it's okay. So I came here, we had no company name, no partner. We also had no contact, no primary contact. So we added both of those. Now we can create a proposal. Proposal in USA, we use the Info Google Drive. In Canada, we use the Glenn Google Drive. Since our, since our document's created now, we're going to duplicate our page. I'm gonna go grab our contact, Brian, copy. Our, our, our uh, stage is project in progress, not common. 
Project in Progress 1. It was common, we used common Project in Progress 1. Project in Progress 1, we're gonna grab our share, photo, share file. We're gonna post, we're gonna HTML that link into our email. Estimate quote deck. 